Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves at the Court of Appeals in New Mexico, where Aselmo finds a door open that's really not supposed to be open to begin with and invites himself in only to be kicked out out fairly expediently so let's go ahead and sit back relax and enjoy the show what's going on guys auditing america i'm at the court appeals of the state of new mexico supreme court let's see many many minutes later Good. How'd you get in the building, buddy? Come on this way. Why? Did you come in through the back entrance? Came through the main entrance. Well, you gotta lie to fraud it, and Ass Elmo is one of the biggest liars in the game. I mean, clearly he went through the side entrance because there was no security guard at that particular entrance right there. So we got a security guard right here and a much more impressive looking door back there. So it kind of makes you wonder at dumbass Elmo. Uh, yeah, you went right in the back entrance and well, you lied about it. You knew that this was not the main entrance. Don't you are into security? You have cameras here. You know where I came from. So you came in through here and you just blurred past my sign? Obviously not. Oh my goodness, ass Elmo. That's such a award-winning attitude right there. Uh, kind of makes me wonder how many jobs have you uh, gotten with that, uh, well, nice little personality and back talk you got right there. Because I can guarantee you at many jobs, uh, well, they wouldn't tolerate that and you would be out the door. Well, then how did you get in the building? There's a public entrance. Through where? Your security, you should know that. Which area did you come in through? The back entrance? Look at the cameras, I should tell you. Come on, man. Make sure you go inside. You can't be in here, man. I have, I have the right to be here. You can't be in here recording, man. Come on. Yes, I do. Are you a cop? Dude, come on. Why, why can't Dude, we? It's, come on, man. Look, bro, let's have a conversation. What the? Why? I have the right to be here. If you're wandering my building without my... Come on, come on. I don't have problem. I don't have a problem going through the metal detector, but what the hell? That's what you come on, bro. Come on, dude. Why are you doing this? There's a, there's a right. This is not. This is. This is not, this is, this is not your building. This is not your building. No. I don't know you. No. Hey, hey, dumbass Elmo. Uh, let me uh, tell you a little secret. This gentleman actually lives in New Mexico. He pays taxes here. This building, he helped pay for. He works in this building to keep it secure, which basically means he has the right to tell people to go if they are posing any kind of risk to the people of that building or the building itself. You, on the other hand, are from Florida. And if you actually do pay taxes, for anything in Florida, well, that's where you would own a really minuscule piece of anything in the state of Florida. I don't know you. Yeah, so come and, come Get on, a supervisor. Bro. Do you work here? Okay, what okay, are you doing here? okay, so. What are you doing here? Lower your voice. What are you doing here? Why are you talking to me what like that? Why are you talking to me what like that? Here? Don't come in here and start to make you threats, man. Come on. Threats? You're how have I? Me with how? Your phone. Oh, I'm threatening, with, oh, I'm threatening him with. I'm threatening him with my phone. Are. I'm threatening you. Come on, it's time to go out. First of all, first of all, you're not supposed de escalate. To first of all, okay, yeah, yeah. Look at the cameras and look where I came in. You guys are so stupid that you have a fully opened entrance on the south entrance of the building, right? Fully opened, no security, very very welcoming and you want to act a fool huh very welcoming huh dumbass elmo uh 
I don't know about you, but to me, that just looks like a hole in the wall right there, pretty much. One that can be uh, construed as an exit for employees, and maybe one of the employees accidentally left the door unlocked, but you don't have to go around uh, calling these people morons because you should reserve that for yourself the amount of times you've been arrested in your life and have never learned a damn thing from it. Secure your building. Secure your building. It's open. It doesn't say restricted. Get out, man. No, get you out. get out. You get out. You get out. You're technically in my building. This get is out. not your building. Get out. This is not your building. Get out. Call I'm your supervisor. I want to speak to your. If you touch, to I'm a citizen. Jur out. I'm a journalist, and if you touch I me, you I will sue you. Call your supervisor. You if you touch me, bro, I'm gonna defend you myself. Don't you, you touch me. Don't you touch me. Don't you touch me. Call the police. Call the police. I'm gonna call the police, right? Yes, because so you need to get out. I don't. I don't like your attitude. You don't treat me like that. You don't. Who does this guy think he is? There's a south entrance. You're fully not open. Through there. That's my delivery. It doesn't say that. Get out the building. You're creating a disturbance now. This guy's this guy's being disorderly. This guy's being disorderly. You see charge of security. But he doesn't have to be dis exactly so secure the building. Uh yeah, that's what he's trying to do, dumbass Elmo. His job is to secure the building, which means to get rid of the ass hats that wanna cause trouble. You know, ass hats like yourself. I'm not giving. Uh, do you work here, sir? Because I need you to stand by here if, if when the police come shows up. Because this guy's screaming, saying that he's gonna physically remove me from here where he has no authority to do that. Uh, question, dumbass Elmo. How do you know exactly what his job entails? Have you uh, looked into the court records or uh, whatever they have around here to determine what his exact role is? Because I really doubt that you have the intelligence to go into their uh, database or whatever and look up the uh, job profiles of these guys, you know, because you're not that intelligent. No, I'm not. You are. You see how, how people lie? There's thousands watching my show, by the way. Uh, what's your name, sir? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? No, I'll talk. I'll talk to the police when they get here. Well, you need to go outside. No, you, you need to. Even in my building. That's, this is not your building. This is not your building. This is not. This is not your building. You have a. You have a very welcoming door. It says South Entrance. I opened the door and I came in, and this guy is going crazy. Do you, are you a supervisor here? Okay, so. What are you here for? Okay, so look, I'll show you around. Look. No, no, I know oh, that entrance is. Where, where are you looking for? I'm just taking pictures of the courthouse. Uh, um, you need to make an appointment? <laughs> well, no, well, well, first of all, he's not doing his job. If you guys have doors. Why? Why? Why would they remove you? Uh, well, because who wants a belligerent asshat moron? Uh, roaming the halls, causing trouble for everybody, making things a lot more stressful on all the employees there, as if their jobs weren't already stressful enough as it is without you, the biggest douchebag in the universe, wandering these halls. Why? Okay, what? Because right now, I need you to leave the building. Why? Because you... you Am I breaking the law? Work. You're not here to take pictures. We don't allow pictures of the court unless you schedule. You don't allow you pictures the of the court. You need to schedule an appointment. Awesome. You can do that. Okay, so so who messed up here? Me or you guys? Because you have an entrance right there, wide open, for the public to enter. And then this guy comes and... must have pulled on the door. I did not. I didn't... I did. Oh, yeah, I opened the door. Like, I opened... Broken entry. Okay. Okay, so I'll... St so I'll... St so so I'll wait. going to be charged. Oh, really? You know really? You got to see... The, you got to see the... You, you got to see the camera. I have nothing to hide. Yeah, you got nothing to hide, which is why you try to hide everything about you, especially your arrest record, which goes back quite a ways and includes let's just say a kidnapping charge so if you have nothing to hide then why don't you just go ahead and tell us why you decided to kidnap that person and hold them against their will i mean inquiring minds want to know 
So it doesn't say restricted area. It doesn't say do not enter. It doesn't say anything like that. So no, and I'm gonna stick outside and when the police shows up, I'll be more than glad to show them. It'd be in your best interest to leave before the police. Oh no, no, because I've done nothing wrong, but I'm leaving right now though. I'm leaving right now. Yeah, no, I'm leaving right now. I'm leaving right now. Excuse me. I'm requesting police assistance, please. Are you a police officer? A police officer? Yes, please. Uh, recommendation or probably to call on emergency numbers. Sir. I'm I'm asking you guys to call, please. Your your, your security here. I... Hey, dumbass Elmo. Uh, I've got an idea. Uh, you've got two hands, right? So why don't you take those two hands, put the cell phone in one hand, and turn off the camera with the other, and then use that available hand to start dialing the local police department. Doesn't that sound like a brilliant idea? Just turn off the dang camera option on your phone and your problem is solved because no one's going to help you out in this situation because you're the idiot that caused the whole situation. I, I walked in the building, right? Right. And dude, uh, uh, it's uh, the entrance. When I opened the door, there's no security there, nothing. So I just kept on walking. And I and I kept on doing my video around the building, right. and and then the security guard comes and he wants to uh, and and he's over here like re going nuts because he has no clue where I came in from. Okay, so it was, it was so a it, it was a misunderstanding, yes. but he um he they didn't secure the other door, bro, and and the end and it says a south entrance. Yeah. And then, south or, or Capital North? Uh, I don't I think know. Because that's Capital North. Well, he's, he's, uh, he said, uh, uh, you broke in, you broke in. And, and then they said they were going to call the police, but I said, I'm calling the police. Right. Oh, poor little ass Elmo, all broken hearted and butthurt that nobody in there was kissing his ass. So why don't you go back home to Florida? Actually, we don't need you here in Florida. We are, we got enough scumbags here. So why don't you take it somewhere outside of Florida that would welcome you? which I don't see any place that would, and go find a quick pillow to cry in. And, well, maybe your mama will uh, ship you some warm milk and chocolate chip cookies while she's at it. Well, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you playing cereal? Who's that?